सबकी बात अगर सुनता मैं मैं भी सबके जैसा होता शुक्र है उन गुरुओं का उन गुरुओं का उन गुरुओं की प्रेरणा का और उनके सटीक ऑब्जर्वेशन का जिन्होंने सही सलाह दी डॉक्टर ओपी मिश्रा जो मेरे फ्रेंड फ्लस पर गाइड थे जब मैं एग्रीकल्चर से साइंटिस्ट एग्जाम की तैयारी कर रहा था मेरे रूम पर आके सर अपने वो नोट्स लेके गए जिस पे वो किताब लिखने वाले थे मेरे को कहा फोटो कॉपी मत करना मैंने जो सीखा राइटिंग स्टाइल से मेरा ए का एग्जाम तो नहीं निकला बट मैं आर ग्रेड भी बाद में निकाल पाया सबसे महत्वपूर्ण है लेकिन सर की और भी मेरे सारे गुरुओं की वो गाइडेंस जो हमेशा सही प्रेरणा देती है सही मार्ग पे चलने के लिए प्रोत्साहित करती है हैप्पी टीचर्स डे टू ऑल माई टीचर्स ऑल माई टीचर्स फ्रेंड्स मेरी लाइफ में एक बार ऐसा हुआ था कि मैं एक महीने के लिए बेड रेस्ट पे हो गया था जॉन्डेस या टाइफाइड हो गया था ट्वेल्थ क्लास में सो मेरी स्टडीज बहुत पीछे हो गई थी तब एक टीचर ने मेरी बहुत हेल्प की थी उसके बाद उन्होंने मुझे बहुत सारे क्वेश्चंस पर्सनली सॉल्व करवाए थे जिससे मैं अच्छा परफॉर्म कर पाया था तो यहाँ से मुझे एक बहुत अच्छी लर्निंग मिली टू हेल्प अदर्स जितने भी स्टूडेंट्स मेरे पास आते हैं कोई भी क्वेरी लेके मैं ट्राई करता हूँ कि उनकी क्वेरी को आंसर कर पाऊं, सो so, ये लर्निंग मुझे मिली है और ये मैं आपको भी देना चाहूंगा कि आप भी जिसकी भी जो मदद कर सकते हैं वो करिए एंड स्टूडेंट्स मेरे जितने भी आई एग्जाम के यहाँ पे टीचर्स हैं जो जितने भी मेरे पुराने टीचर्स हैं कलीग्स हैं उनको मैं बोलूंगा हैप्पी टीचर्स डे हैप्पी टीचर्स डे Today I will share one incident from my school, uh, the economics uh, class. Uh, my teacher, Mrs. Narula, she was a very strict teacher, and we found her strict uh, and we were scared of her for the simple reason she would just pick up anybody any day in the class and ask to explain any concept that she would have discussed with us or explained to us uh, previously. We used to be very scared, hoping it's not uh, my turn. But uh, whenever we did give answers, you know, she was not happy, and we used to be very confused. Why is she never happy with our answer when we've told exactly what is written in the book? Later, only did we realize that was exactly the problem. That we stated exactly what was written in the book rather than understanding and stating what we understood from that concept. That is one lesson I have learned, and I would advise all of you to follow. Understand what you study, and there will be no exam that you will find difficult. Wishing you happy Teachers Day once again. Today, I will share a story. I was in class 10th. I remember I was given a speech in school assembly. So I was very hesitant. I mean, I did not go. So my class teacher, Sister Elsa, she walked up to me and she said, "Sir, you are very hesitant. 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 So this is one of the life-changing moment जो मैं जिंदगी भर उन उस teacher के sister ऐसा कि मैं याद रखूँगा happy teachers day. So one memory of my teacher is that I was in school and I was conducting an assembly and I was speaking uh, in the middle of the stage while I forgot my lines uh, and there was a pause of good thirty seconds but somehow I managed and it got over. And after that, I went to ma'am. I was crying. I was just in fifth standard, a little girl. I went to ma'am, crying, sad, embarrassed. So I was saying, I'm sorry, I spoiled everything. It went so bad. But my teacher said, No, no, it was not noticeable. It was so good. Your tone was good. She motivated me so much. And not only she motivated me, she gave me chances. Till I was in twelfth standard, I was her person uh, to give a welcome speech or vote of thanks or conduct an entire event. So what I learned from this is that a person may be having a bad day or a bad phase. and that is not when we should judge the person or make decisions according to that if we give chances to the other person we never know when a person blooms so on this teachers day i would like to remember one of my teachers who always encouraged me and motivated me especially when i was preparing appearing for first board examination of my life that is 8th standard i was having a self doubt and i was losing confidence but she always encouraged me that yes you can do and don't get scared of any situation or any challenges in life and that only happened that i secured a merit position in the board examination and i was the only candidate to do so so i really learned a valuable lesson from her teachings that it is futile to just lose confidence and having the self doubt just give your best and move ahead for that i also wrote one poem in one of my blogs which i would like to narrate here it's titled as phoenix a bird who rises from ashes survive those ghastly flames and rose into the sky with a desire to reach the pinnacle and spirit soaring high mountains you tame to feel the morning's delight 
singing song of victory with your wings shining so bright a mind so clear free from brazen voices flying higher and far leaving behind the shrill noises forget the past as new day has begun sky is your destiny and your reward is the peace of sun the darkness engulfed you in the longest night yet the phoenix in you endured and prevailed with an exemplary might so I always have confidence in you and faith in your abilities thank you in my life teacher has played a very important role i remember those teachers who were actually very friendly and have given me immense knowledge the correct knowledge uh, the specific knowledge in a very right manner which was understandable so i have taken this lesson from them that uh, if i have to teach another kid then i have to understand his level his problem and then have to teach him in a way such that it is understandable she sings really well doesn't she these type statements are called question tags when i was in my 7th standard i used to have issues with question tags i was a good student to pura class was surprised ki ise question tags mein kaise issues ho sakte hain my teacher without getting frustrated asked me ki what was the issue then he got to know that i had some pre concept notion that question tags are really tough maybe mujhe kisi ne pehle bol diya hoga to mujhe already dimag mein ye tha ki question tags are really tough then he advised me one thing not to fear of the unknown i would like to advise the same thing to all of you not to fear of the unknown if you encounter anything new face it then you will get to know it then overcome it